Okay, I think I saw some invisible people. Let's get this old gas rifle out. Gotcha. Where'd you go, you predator wannabe? Chief. It's no wonder the fucking lost a nuclear war. Whoops. Let's get moving, Sergeant. Look at them, they're all snuggled together. That's the front down there. These guns are pounding on our guns. Let's take them out. Holy fuck.
plant some bombs. Now we're talking. Damn fine work you did taking out those guns. Damn fine. I know this. Yeah, yeah, make with the next objective so I can finish the simulation. This is no simulation, soldier. That's real blood you see out there on the snow. I got enough to worry about without some hotshot like you breaking protocol. Now get it together. You have a job to do. Am I clear, soldier? <sighs> this isn't even real. Soldier, you're fixing to have a size 10 combat boot shoved up your candy ass. Oh, you're real Your tough, attitude's Gramps. just earned you a demerit. I don't want to hear that kind of talk out of you again. Is that crystal clear enough now? Very clear. Sorry, sir. We're all a bit strung out from the last commie bombing run on our field HQ. We lost some good men, including my strike team commander, Colonel Patterson. Guess he sucked. They knew the drill when they signed up, sir. Kami, sons of bitches. It'll be a cold day in hell before I let them cross Canada into the mainland. But enough of that. I called you down here for a reason. You've earned yourself a field promotion, soldier. From this moment on, you're in charge of Patterson's strike team. What are my orders, sir? There are three hardened targets that stand between us and the Chinese headquarters. That's where your strike team comes in. Follow me over to the situation map, and I'll bring you up to speed. Okay. Okay, pay attention, soldier. I'm only gonna go through this once. We've set up our new field HQ down here. The area is pretty secure now that the artillery guns are gone. The first of the three targets we need to handle is their Chimera Depot over here. Be careful on your approach. You're gonna have to get through the enemy camp on the way. Once you breach the perimeter of the depot, you need to take out both of the main fuel tanks. Your second target is all the way over here. The Chinese have set up a listening post set into the side of Callaway Ridge. There are some abandoned mines along the route, so keep your eyes and ears open. It's a great place for an ambush. You need to clear the place of personnel, so we can get our intelligence boys in there to start decoding. 
Once the first two targets are down, the last obstacle standing in the way is their damn pulse field. You need to cross it, then cause it to overload so we can mop up the place with the T-51Bs. Let me warn you now, unless you have some sort of a death wish, I wouldn't even go near the field until the first two targets are down. Lieutenant Morgan will be your eyes and ears for Operation Anchorage, so get everything up from him. Uncle Sam's invested a lot of money turning you into a killing machine. Time to pay him back. Dismissed. Okay. Yeah. So, you're in charge of Patterson's suicide squad, huh? Suicide squad? Why do they call it that? Do I really have to answer that? You aren't going after civilian targets, you know. This is the big leagues. Anyway, I'm here to give you a hand with intelligence and logistics. Whatever you need, I'm your guy. I hope you know more about the strike team, because I sure don't. Don't worry about it. Sergeant Montgomery will be your squad commander, and he knows all the ins and outs of the team. If you need anything, like reinforcements or status reports, just speak to him. So, what else can I do for you before you hit the field? I'm looking for your latest intel reports. That's my specialty. Give me the latest on the Chimera Depot. You've got two fuel tanks to destroy. One in the central courtyard of the facility and one near the rear gate. This place is one tough nut to crack. Not only do you have the Chimeras to contend with, but the place is heavily populated by infantry. Give me the latest on the listening posts. Oh, this place is a honeypot, let me tell you. Not only is it swarming with regular ground troops, but they've put their best guys in there as well, the Crimson Dragoons. I hear those guys start training as soldiers right from the womb, so watch yourself in there. Give me the latest on the pulse field. The problem out there isn't the field itself. I mean, you wouldn't be foolish enough to drag robots out there with you. The place is crawling with their stealth units, the Crimson Dragoons. If you spot something out of the corner of your eye, shoot first and ask questions later, or it's the last thing you'll ever see. That's what I usually do. I need some gear, where can you set me up? Can do. Just use the requisition terminal here in the command tent. Pick whatever loadout you need, and the terminal will dispense a requisition tape. Bring it to the quartermaster officer and you're all set. The government sure loves its paperwork, doesn't it? Need to discuss my strike team. Okay. How do I put together my strike team? Uncle Sam's made it really easy for you. All you have to do is use use the recruitment markers I gave you and choose. Then head outside to the barracks and your units will be... Can I just take the whole bunch of guys with me? No way. The bigger your strike team, the bigger your footprint on all the Chinese sensing devices. You need to think small. The recruitment markers I gave you will recommend what size you keep your team in order to maintain the smallest footprint possible. So to put it simply, you pick a big clunky robot and you won't have much room left in the team for many other units. You decide. What if I lose a strike team member? You can always speak to your strike team squad leader and requisition a new unit if you've lost one. Have to go now. Remember that your strike team members got families too, you know. Let's yeah. send them home alive instead of in a pine box. Got it? Whatever. You're all simulation. Those targets can't secure themselves. You've got a job to do, so you now shut up.
Hope the operation is going well. Alright, let's get out of here.